new storm team. Welcome back everyone. We're going to start this out taking a look at our temperatures right now. So we have quite the spread. We've got 20s and 30s up to the north and as you head down south, quite a bit warmer. We got 50s, almost some 60s down there, then 40s in the middle. Your absolute comfort plumbing and heating wind chill report here. The wind chills aren't looking too bad either. Not seeing a whole lot of wind chills because if we take a look at our winds right now, not a whole lot of winds going on. Pretty calm winds. We've got winds calm just about to 10 miles an hour here. And if we take a look at our satellite and radar, lots of clear skies, lots of sunshine, and not a whole lot going on here. So if we go ahead and roll precision cast as we continue into the night, we will be staying dry and as we wake up tomorrow, seeing quite a bit of sunshine, a little more clouds up to the north. And then as we continue into Saturday, we will start to see some snow and maybe some rain, maybe some wintry mix move into that northwest corner in the afternoon hours that'll move through saturday into the evening hours as well and then as we head into sunday morning christmas eve morning here we are looking at some rain some wintry mix maybe some freezing rain and some snow here for christmas eve morning so if you are planning on traveling saturday is likely going to be the better day to do it if you can because we are expecting those roads, especially if you're heading eastbound, to get very icy. So you're gonna wanna make sure that you're staying updated on the latest forecast, the latest road conditions, if you are heading anywhere on Sunday. As we continue throughout Sunday into the afternoon, we're still seeing that snow, but then as we head into the evening, we will start to clear up, seeing quite a bit of sunshine after we see that snowfall. And then as we head into Monday, Christmas day, we are looking to stay mostly dry and once again, seeing quite a bit of sun, but we will see a bit of clouds here and there. Here's a look at the potential snowfall accumulation through Sunday. So most of the state is looking at at least a trace to about an inch. And then we're gonna see higher totals down to the southeast, about an inch to maybe three inches, and then maybe three to five inches for the southeast there. Of course, this is subject to change. So once again, just make sure that you're staying updated with the forecast. As we head into Saturday night into Sunday morning, winds will be picking up, seeing wind gusts 30, 35, maybe some 40s. And those will continue as we head into Sunday morning as well. Could see some wind advisories and we'll keep you updated on that. And heading into Sunday, still seeing 30, 35 mile an hour wind gusts, which could also lead to difficult travel on Sunday. So Sunday is just not looking to be a great day to travel. And as we head into Monday, they will mostly calm down, still seeing a bit of those 15, 25 mile an hour winds. And if we take a look at our fog forecast, we are likely to be seeing that fog form throughout the night tonight, again into tomorrow morning. So don't be surprised if we wake up to some fog and we do actually still have a dense fog advisory up to the north here. They extended it, extended it into tomorrow morning and we are looking to likely see it, them extend it into tomorrow morning for more counties as well. Your Dickinson five day forecast, we're starting in the 40s, we'll cool off a little bit, then we warm back up into the 40s. Willison's five day forecast here. We are looking to stay mostly dry through the week and lots of sunshine Monday and Wednesday. Minot seven day forecast, a little bit of chance for that snow on Christmas Eve, but otherwise we're looking to stay pretty dry and seeing a lot of sun. In Bismarck seven day forecast, we are likely to see that snow Saturday night and into Sunday. So, you know, hoping for a white Christmas here, but we are still so warm. We need mm -hmm. to cool off. Yeah, this doesn't knock it off. We're going to start doing like setting like daily high records here, like all time or something. <laughs> we did. We just set a record yesterday. Dickinson did. I mean, uh, Come on, get colder. We I think it's snow miser. at some point the weather has to flip. It says, all right, we had our fun. Let's yes. go ahead and chill things down yes. now. Let's go. Carolyn, thank you so much. Stay with us coming up next with everything caught.